What's up YouTube? It's a beautiful sunny morning. Unfortunately it's cold outside, but hey, I got this package. Gonna do an unboxing real quick. And let's see what we got. We got another squishy envelope, which that means it's gonna be another unpackage. Oops, unpackaging. Don't want to cut something I don't want to cut. Scissors down. What do we got today? We got the power pole wireless foot switch. I've been waiting on this for a little while. A long time ago I had the original wireless foot switch, which, it, which I didn't really care for that much. The buttons were too small and uh, it only stayed on the boat for a little while and I sold, sold it on eBay. So I thought I'd give these a try. Let's get it open. Back to the scissors, bam. Try not to tear the box up too much. Oh, wait, there's the front of the box. So we have uh, foot switches, uh, or should I say, we have a foot switch for each motion. You do a double tap, tap tap, the power poles come up, tap tap, the power poles go down. And you have to um, sync these up through Sea Monster, and they will operate wirelessly. Pretty cool little setup. I'm pretty sure I'm going to like these. Much better than the original with switches. Pry that open to get to the batteries. Or the battery, I'm assuming. So there you are. That is the unboxing of the PowerPole wireless foot switch. I can't wait to try these bad boys out. It's still a little early in the season. Looks like a pretty nice setup. I'm sure that, uh, well, I'm really hoping that it's going to be just what the doctor ordered. I don't mind wearing the little uh, lanyard around the neck, but this would be a whole lot more um, convenient. Sometimes that lanyard gets in the way. But hey, here it is. There it is. Power pole standard foot switch, wireless, using the Sea Monster control system. Topwater Tony. Peace.